everybody, it's Dawn and welcome back to my channel. So today I have some surprise friend mail from my friend Donna from Creative by Nature. Uh, Donna has two channels now actually. So the first one is Creative by Nature DIYs and Decor where she does DIYs and decor and Donna brings a lot of nature, which is in her title, uh, into her um, what she makes, it's fantastic. Then she mo recently, a few months back, started a, another channel, Creative by Nature Art and Life, where she does, that's where she's doing her art, her, she, most of her hauls, she's still doing some hauls on the DIY channel, but most of her hauls are now on the uh, Art and Life, where she, Donna does fantastic art, she's working on right now like a gardening, junk journal type thing so definitely check out both her channels that I will link them down below I'm sure most of you who are subscribed to me know who Donna is uh, creative by nature is but if for whatever reason you don't she's like the gnome queen <laughs> um, if you don't then definitely go check her out you will not be disappointed at all like and anyway so Donna and I, I'm rambly, but Donna and I started our channels around the same time and that's kind of how we met actually. Uh, I don't remember on whose channel it was, but she she had just started a channel and said, you know, we, we got talking and for, for whatever reason, it blew up into a full on friendship. We talk nearly every day, not always because we're both mamas. <laughs> And we both have busy lives, but we talk frequently, let's say frequently, and we have become really good friends. I wish we lived closer. We are a few provinces apart, uh, but we talk and yeah, I just, I just love you, Donna. So um, becoming friends with you is like awesome and yeah, you're like a a missing missing piece of my life so anyway that I have in my life now so that being said Donna wanted to join my memory decks challenge as you all know I'm still running a memory decks challenge until November 15th she told me she was entering and mailed out my memory decks well guys there's more than a memory decks I just opened the box just for the addresses and this table shaking a bit uh, so we will get to the memory decks. It's somewhere in here and At the end at that point I'm just gonna flip the camera and I will do her memory decks entry the same way I did everyone else's because I like you guys to see them better But I wanted to film the friend mail up front So I'm gonna jump with the card jump in opening the card I see people Oh my goodness, look at this. I love this. Where do you guys, like, where do you find this, Donna? I love this. Aww. Aww. Well, like I said, I already said that without reading the card, like, being. Ba she said being the like she didn't write like the friend thing is her personal favorite same aside from everything else making friends like yeah being friends with you that's the best donna supports me in so many ways you guys it's awesome there's a little note here yeah if it, she just basically said everything I told you guys. We live a distance away, but we've become really good friends, supportive of each other. Aww. Oh, I'm... Aww. Thank you. Okay. <sighs> okay. I'm such an emotional person. Donna, you're making me cry and I haven't even got past the card. <laughs> that card is beautiful. You didn't have to send me anything, but just that card means the world. Okay, I'm gonna be turning a lot, unless I set this in my lap. This box is huge, you guys. So I have, Donna and I, like I said, we've been talking and there, we've had these little 
piles for each other like if she's picked something up or I've gotten something for her like there's a few things that she knows I've gotten for her and I still have yet to send send hers out but I guess yeah Donna <laughs> okay let's just jump in all right so I had to take these off I'll show you there she sent me two packages of these beautiful peacock wall stickers which I'm totally guys I can't wait I am totally putting these on my one wall downstairs so yeah sometime you will see my craft room it's not gonna be anytime soon but you will and when you do you will see these guys on my wall thank you they're so pretty so pretty I love these I love them so much thank you Donna and then she also sent me some of these look at these you guys real peacock feathers look at this two packs of them look at those sorry about the glare everybody I absolutely love these I'm totally gonna come up with a DIY for these actually I do have something I want to uh, make for Christmas if I get to it you guys I have so many ideas it's my problem i'll tell you what it is i love creating and i love i don't mind being on the camera or anything like that for me it's the editing which as you see if you see some of my videos i am working at that and my husband's helped me with a few he can't help me with all of them so i need to learn but i'm doing my best so i might end up getting some diys up that aren't edited we'll just do it dawn styles just so you guys can see but uh yeah i'm I'm having fun with it so yeah okay there's this pink package here so I'm just gonna open that up my husband is off today not that he's always here but <laughs> he works from home still uh, but he's out sawing logs right now he's out sawing lumber so if you hear the sawmill I hope it's not I hear it running I don't know if you guys can I apologize but I have to film while nobody's in the house <laughs> the boys are at school still this afternoon so yeah <gasps> oh Donna thank you so much <gasps> oh my goodness these are beautiful she has sent me snowshoe ornaments she has made the coolest gnomes it's gnomes with these and i will link again i'm linking her videos but if i i'm linking her channels but if i there's certain videos that i know that yes so there's a gnome she's made which i will link that too with these snowshoes and i remember commenting on it saying how much i absolutely love them and she she did say she was going to get me a pair she sent Donna, thank you. She sent me three pairs. Oh, I love these. Thank you so much. I'm gonna be doing more than like just gnomes with them though. I love them, like even in a tree. Again, my husband is from Northern Ontario where there's like Sault Ste. Marie where there's mega snow. His grandfather, I actually have him in the basement, made snowshoes, made his own snowshoes. I still have that pair. Now everyone, like these are the traditional kind now everyone wears the metal ones i still though every once in a while when i go out there i still love wearing the wooden ones like i have his pair it has a broken the one the homemade ones my grandfather or my husband's grandfather uh it's they're not wearable anymore the straps broken it would need to be fixed and we don't want to wear them uh they're a heirloom so it, they're more just to hang on the wall but yeah every once in a while i'll still strap on a pair of the old style and wear them up there they are kind of fun a fun thrift find oh I love this uh, not I love this file folder actually oh, love that let me see what did you find Donna also loves thrifting just like I do so that's something else I think thrifting is mainly on her art and life channel now okay. oh, Donna Oh my goodness oh my goodness I should not film on hormonal days <laughs> guys look at this 
It's needle. Oh my gosh, Donna. Look at this. It's needlework peacock. I am so framing this. I am going to find the perfect frame for this. Oh, this one I think. I was going to say, I think this one has to go in my bedroom. I have the perfect spot for it. Oh, and it's vintage. Oh my gosh. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Somebody has put a lot of work into that. Yeah. Look at. And if they had known, well, oh, I was going to say, if they had known Thelma Hall, Thelma would have said they should put their initials in it, but they did. I think. I think there, but I'm not sure. Or is that just Mandarin? Anyway, it's gorgeous. Thank you. Donna, I'm going to find the perfect frame, and I will show you how I uh, mount that or whatever. Oh, oh so pretty. Oh, my God. Oh girl. All right, there is this envelope here. Love, where'd you find these? The Prince Charming Collection from Studio C, but I just love this envelope. What is this? Did you make these? I think she made these, you guys. So, Donna has, I think, yeah, you made these. We need to get you a stamp, Donna. <laughs> Some ideas. We need to get you a stamp that says, like, your, your stamp. Okay, so Donna has a Cricut Joy. Again, I will link to the video about that. And... I think these are made with her Cricut Joy. I really do. And they are gorgeous. I love this iridescent or holographic paper she's put in the back of the screen. It's gonna glare you. Sorry guys. Look at that. I love that. It's like a little village. Oh, it's so pretty. So there's that one. It's gonna be a long video, you guys. Oh yeah, it's gonna be a long video. And then, oh, the mason jar with the hearts. Oh, that's going to be so cool for Valentine's Day. And then this pot of flowers. And then she's left them all blank inside. So then I can stamp and I can, oh, definitely reuse these. Like, I will send these out. Thank you. Thank you so much, Donna. They are so cool. I want a Cricut Joy now. <laughs> I want it all though. I have a Cricut expression that, it's a long video, I should tell you this in another video everyone. I have a Cricut expression, but mine has internet access, so I've never had to get the Explore Air or the Maker yet, because it still cuts well and I can still get SVG files online. Uh, there used to be a program called Sir Cuts A Lot through Provocraft, it got shut down uh, a number of years ago, but I still, because we bought the program, I still have access to it. It's when Cricut went that way themselves, they uh, weren't too happy with Provo, Provo Craft doing that to their program. <laughs> oh, these are so pretty. So she has sent me some metal charms. Look at this peacock. Thank you. And the starfish and the bee. Oh my goodness, I'm going to have so much fun with that. You spoiled me, Donna. Then we have the swirl gems. Oh, so pretty, I love those. She knows I love my pinks. Never seen these. These are floral embellishments. Oh my goodness, they're like handmade. With glass gems, or with gems, it says. Look at those, you guys. So pretty. I really need to start journal like journals. <gasps> and I love these sequins. These are like my favorite colors. Look at this. So pretty. Thank you so much, Donna. Oh my goodness, this box, you guys, I haven't even put a dent in it. So she has sent me this ribbon. Thank you so much. In the beige. Donna got this. Okay, so last year when they were at Dollar. Last year when Dollar Tree were bringing out, I think they brought it like Christmas colors. Donna had found this at one of her stores. I can't remember if it was your dollar store with more or um, 
they go to this store called Scattered Goods. Anyway, they, uh, she said there was beige and I was like, oh, so she said she would get one for me and then Dollar Tree came out with them, but beige is so, I use beige a lot. I love these colors, so thank you so much, Donna. I, uh, Dollar Tree just has never brought them back, so yeah, totally awesome. Okay, here's the memory deck, so we'll save that. We're not gonna open that yet. Then we have, oh, thank you so much, Donna. She sent me one of these bottle lights. I can't wait to make something for Christmas with this. Thank you so much. Oh, love it. Oh my goodness. You remembered. Okay. Last, is it before Christmas even? I think so. I, I can't remember. The one thing about Donna and I is we are so alike in the sense we're like, we're going to do something. We're going to do something. And then... We both get busy and it's like, sorry, uh, I got to put that on hold. And anyway, so we said we were going to make an embellishment box for each other. And then we never really confirmed when we were doing it. She's done hers. <laughs> you're awesome. Oh my goodness, you're awesome. So look at how she's made this. Look at this. So it's this beautiful, like, corally peachy flower which i absolutely love this color with the greens i love how you made this vintage and then is this material yeah it's like this material that it's got waves look at that like sand like you know when water comes up on the sand that's what it reminds me of and then she's done a burlap strip here with lace and then she's put these leaves behind and then look at this trim you guys i'm gonna lose that box this is Dunning Donna, and she has filled this thing. Oh, you filled this thing. Donna, this is awesome. How? Oh. So, guys, it's just full of goodies. So, I'm going to show you. Start on the left. She has sent me some of this craft decor glitter and the silver, which I couldn't find. And thank you, Donna. Thank you so much. When I remember, I don't know if you guys remember, I was on a hunt for this. I had to have every single one. <laughs> Donna hooked me up with the silver. Then she's made, oh my goodness, this is gorgeous. Okay, I'm just gonna set this here. Sorry if I shake you guys, this table's not very sturdy. This butterfly paper clip. Oh, this is gorgeous. So that. Then she's made Oh, I love this one. I like how you did that uh, flag style. So pretty. I love the pinks. And then same one. She's made another flag style one here. Love this. And then we have all kinds of uh, cutouts. Are these, uh, I'm not sure if they're from Tim Holtz or not. They, they remind me of the Tim Holtz paper dolls. I think they are, but I'm not sure. Whole bunch of those, you guys. Then a whole bunch of these floral cardstock images. Oh, Donna, these are gorgeous. So pretty, you guys. Look at more of these paper dolls. Whole but Donna, you spoiled me. So many of these paper dolls. Oh, so many. Oh, look at the guy and his uh, greyhound. I have a thing for big dogs. I love big dogs. And then all of these uh, die cut. Okay, I'm gonna set this here. Try not to shake this table. All of these. There we go. Cardstock cutouts. Oh, love these like book pieces. I love that. Are you another one sending me stuff to start a journal? <laughs> Everybody wants me to start journals. My two front runners uh, are Tina F and Linda at H-65. 
Yes, Donna, I will definitely use these in the journal. And yeah, some more that she's punched out. I love those, Ooh, so pretty. Yes, thank you so much. Okay, that's not it, you guys. Then she has sent, look at these. These uh, flower, they're burlap flowers with, did you make those? I think she made these, you guys. Look at those. You made those, didn't you? They're gorgeous. And then, oh, oh, these are so pretty. Oh my goodness, she sent all these beads. Look at them all. They're so pretty, and they already have the, the, um, you know, the loop in them. Oh, Donna, are, look at, some of these look so vintage even. Thank you for sharing these with me. Oh my gosh, they are so cool. And then look at this one in here. I would even make a necklace out of that one actually. I might, for like spring, It'd be so fun. I love that one. I love them all. I love them, thank you. Oh, I love them. And then she sent me, this one has all of these beautiful paper flowers, like of every color, whole bunch of those. So that, this compartment here is full of those. Love this pink one here, look at this. Love that, so pretty. So those, and then in this compartment, she has sent these. I can't, did you make those? I don't know. These, uh, they're paper flowers with uh, rhinestones on them. Oh, they're so pretty. And then, this set has like a pearl on it. Oh, they're so pretty. I love them. Those. And then there are those ones in there. Oh, I love these. Then we move over to this one and I, she sent some, look at, love these colors. These uh, pom-pom paper clips. I can't talk. And so there's three of those. So. And then this, these paper clip um, tassels, love those, thank you. I'm not gonna be able to get this closed again. And then she has punched out, oh, that's a lot of work. She has punched out tons of circles, flowers, looks like Oh, butterflies in all these beautiful papers and colors. That is such a good idea. So a whole bag of that. So I can use that in so many different, focus, look at the glitter one down there. Uh, so many different um, crafting ventures, you know? And then a whole bunch more. And this one is, Oh, this one's butterflies, birds, flowers, and it's all a heart. And this is all in these beautiful pink, um, iridescent white, whites, and metallics. So, so pretty. I love those colors. Oh, Donna, thank you. And then look at how she's topped them all. I should have showed you that too. So anything in a bag, she's topped with this really pretty washi. So pretty. And then in this one, look at, what a clever idea. She has wrapped washi tape around these thimbles. That is such a cool idea. And I love the thimbles, or not thimbles, spools, thread spools. Not thimbles, sorry. Thread spools, what a good idea. So she's sent me these two washies on them. That is such a cool idea. And then there is, oh, see, I see, it's unraveled, okay, sorry. There we go. So she's got that one, I love that washi, Donna. And then this one, and then, oh, I love this one. This one says, dream big. Well, I'm a dreamer. <laughs> I always dream big. And this is such, so pretty what a great idea that is a fantastic idea and then she sent me these ones the metallic pink polka dots and then this 
blue and pink stripe washi. Thank you so much. I just love how you put it on those thread spools. This one has, this pocket has a whole bunch of buttons and they look so vintage and so pretty. Thank you so much, Donna. And then, what's here? Oh, this is cool. So she has made some bobby pins. Oh, this is gonna be so cool for journals, yes. Sorry guys. Look at this. So she's got on, um, what are these called? These, these things, <laughs> the shaker bit in on a bobby pin. So there's that one. Then this one, I love this, how you put this, she put a vintage button on this bobby pin. And then this one, I love how you did that. This is gonna be so, I would even wear that in my hair actually. Um, in journals, I would wear this one in my hair as well. So journals or my hair. And then, oh, okay. So I'm out of these. I had these and I love these so much. I share them in a lot of things that I send to people or whatever. I love these birds. When they were at the stores, I should have, I would have should have bought tons. So thank you. These ones I'm going to keep <laughs> and not, and keep them like in for my journals that I make. And then look at, I never could find these ones. They're the people ones. I love those. I have an idea for those too. <laughs> love them. Then this folder here has these uh, really fine micro beads. So there's purple. Then there's this pink one. Thank you, Donna. And this really pretty blue one. Oh, those are so pretty. Thank you so much. Where'd you find those? I love them. So those, and then this really pretty lace. I love that. Moss, my husband's in here. The moss green lace. So pretty, or, or light green. And then it's a really pretty lace pattern too. And in white. All I want to do is craft. Lately, that's all I've been wanting to do, you guys, is do DIYs and crafts and watch your guys' YouTube videos while I do that. But, you know, there's cooking, cleaning, laundry, you know, pets, chickens. <laughs> I have to clean out my coop, actually. I want to winter. I get it ready for winter. So look at this. She's made this uh, clothes peg flower. So pretty. And she's made three of those. And in this one, oh, so pretty. She sent me this Recollections sequin ribbon in my favorite color. Oh, that is so fun. I can't wait. Thank you so much. I can't wait to use that. And then I'm all over the place. I'm not going in rows or anything. Then this one has this, I love these containers. Iridescent sequins and hearts and stars and the, your typical sequin shape. That is gorgeous. I'm like a little kid, I love all that stuff. And then, oh, this is so cool too. Another a little jar of all these beautiful, and the camera's not focusing, seed beads. My dog's trying to get in here. And then look at this, you guys, look at this. Where did you find this? Look at this, it's uh, peacock eye beads. I don't want to lose that box, or the box is going to slip off my lap. Look at them. Thank you, Donna. Oh, I can't wait to make something with this. See, this is the thing. I also want to do this right now. Oh, thank you so much. Where did you find that? And then, oh my goodness. Okay, so I got to open this one. It's in a bag and I can't, I don't know what it is, so I have to open it. not one I can oh I thought my husband came in he came in and shut the we have a door that shuts to our kitchen and then a door that shuts over there to our living room he came and shut the doors but and I thought he was coming in but he's back out I hear the lawnmower oh my goodness this is gorgeous okay it's a peacock he just got all jingle jangled here and he's layered, like he's a layered metal peacock, beaded. Oh, Donna, this is so beautiful. Look at this, you guys. 
Wouldn't that be gorgeous on the front of, well, on the front of a journal, on a necklace? There's so many possibilities with this, you guys. Look at that. Oh my goodness, girl. Thank you so much. Oh, so that was, that's the, just the embellishment box, you guys. Donna. Girl. Oh, you're awesome. Okay, I'm just gonna, I will just set this aside and I, I wanna put it back properly after, but if I do it on camera, this is running. This is running, it's going. Okay, here I see in the corner this beautiful ribbon. It's in this really, really pretty, almost like a rose gold glitter. And then it's this, it's, Still glittered, same color tone. I don't have these, but just not as glittery. Isn't that so pretty? I love my pinks. Oh, I love it. Thank you so much. She thought this would be fun for mixed media. I love even the uh, tissue paper. I can't find cool tissue paper very often. Once in a while, I'll come across it. But this one would be really cool for decoupage type things. So I don't wanna, I'm gonna try and save as much of it as I can. If I, yeah, oh yeah, I'll be able to. She double layered this. Oh, it will be, yeah. So what it is, and she said in her little note here, she thought it would be fun for mixed media. What it is, it's a hyper-realistic tattoo. So what it is, it's makeup to make it look like you have a tattoo. So I don't really know how to use it yet. Um, so you, you get a stencil, which she sent me the stencil here. What a cool idea. So, you know, I might even just try this out, to be honest with you. <laughs> Do a big one on my leg today. Because I can wear shorts today. It's like 19. Uh, anyway, so you can, so there's the stencil, which, yes, I see, like, for mixed media. And then if you're doing it on your skin or anything, then it comes with the colors. So, place mesh stencil adhesive on skin or on your surface. And then brush color over stencil, remove stencil, dry and set with the powder. So then it comes with the, the, the colors. The powder, I have never even seen these. Never even seen those. That is fantastic. And yeah, so perfect for mixed media. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Thank you. Where'd you ever find that? That is so cool. Art for the table, napkins. Look at this whole pack you should have kept some for yourself but maybe people don't like peacocks as much as I do I don't know but anyway she sent me a whole pack of these I do not have these ones and it's interesting because our grocery store like the local one uh, you know when you need to run and just get a few groceries because it's crazy expensive it's called Foodland they have this art for the table brand every time they put them on sale i look i've never even seen these ones there so thank you oh i love them i love them and then okay do you guys go back to when the beads were at dollarama it was it's over a year ago i could not find the clear ones well donna found the clear ones and she couldn't find a certain color and I have them here. They will be going to her. So I'll wait till, but yeah, so I have her. So we uh, got each other the colors we were missing. Thank you so much. Thank you, Donna. And this box is still going, you guys. There is this pile of stuff here. I'm just trying not to shake you guys. So she has found, so this is a Hallmark, oh, thank you. A Hallmark card with the peacock, like the eye, I, these are the eyes, they're called eyes. So it's got the peacock feathers and you see the eyes and it's a blank card. So I will be using that like in a journal. I'm going to do a peacock journal. You know how you're doing a garden journal, Donna? I think I'm gonna do a peacock journal. 
just because I have so much peacock stuff and it'll be so fun and so me. So I'll be saving all these for that. Look at this or framing them. I could do a, a wall gallery too. Again, this one's a blank one, but I will not be using these for greeting cards, no. And then there is this one. I love how whimsical this one is. Look at, very, yeah. And again, blank inside. Yeah, definitely using those in a journal or like a frame, a frame wall gallery. Come out with some. <laughs> this says it all. Really, it says it all. Love the colors. Love the expression. Yeah, I'm trouble. I'm trouble. <laughs> this is how I feel whenever I watch your guys' hauls. You're all, you're all in trouble. <laughs> Thank you so much, Donna. I love notebooks too, so thank you. I was just saying that I was actually just talking to Donna this morning about how my husband and I were talking about YouTube and how I need to write things down. And I'm going to use that book for that. I'll say, look, Donna even knew. Donna sent me a book, Mark. <laughs> Call it my YouTube book. I'm opening this package here. Thank you so much. Okay, so I'm shaking you guys a bit, I'm sorry. So <laughs> I got a little bit of a message after I hauled these about, and uh, you guys too, everybody goes shopping and I've gotten you guys stuff, but I ended up sending mine to Karen. So Donna said, don't go, like don't buy more. So she has sent me the iridescent beads in the blue. Cause I could only find like one pack of certain colors. So Donna in my haul message, like message me after the video went up and said, just send it to Karen. Don't go buy more. Cause I'd said I was going to go buy more. Uh, she sent me them in the pink. This is my favorite. Oh, love it. And then in the iridescent, uh, white. So yeah, I love beading is so fun. So yeah. Thank you, Donna. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And we're still going. Another package here. Should I hurry up, you guys? I'm sorry. But I can't. I can't. I'm... Let's <laughs> say this while, while I'm opening this. We were... Um, or my family makes fun of me. They're like, just hurry up and open stuff. You take forever. I'm like, yeah, because I like to see everything. Like... I pay attention to detail and I love that. Okay. Oh, thank you. So where I live in Ontario, there is no your dollar store with more. The closest one for me is about an hour and 20 minutes away. And I can't find this in my area. So Donna has hooked me up with two rolls of this stuff is fantastic. Thank you. I'm down to my last roll, Donna. I found it last year when I was with Rula. So thank you so much. Super tacky. Thank you. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you. I have to actually hide that on my husband. He likes this stuff too. <laughs> Sorry, I'm shaking you guys. And then, what is this? A cardboard peacock. I've never even seen. Okay, it's from Dollarama. That's why. It says, make a cute peacock. Look at this, make your own. It's like, a, almost looks like quilling, look. Yeah, it does. So gonna make that, I will share that with you guys. I have never seen him there. I've honestly never seen him there, or I would have bought it. So, you got something I didn't buy. Thank you so much, what a surprise, thank you. And more of this beautiful tissue paper. She's got everything just so pretty and pink, you guys. Pretty and pink. You saw that movie. I haven't seen that movie in ages. And I have all sons, so I can't share my love of like the 80s movies with them because they're not into that. Like, oh, we watch the other ones, but not like those, you know, or Breakfast at Tiffany's and all that. Like, I don't have daughters, so I'll have to wait until my nieces are of the ages and then I'll watch it with them. Oh, create. Oh. 
Oh my goodness, look at the bluebirds. If my father-in-law were to see these, he absolutely loved them. My grandma did too, but look. Oh, they are stunning, Donna. Thank you, I've never seen those. And these either. Look at their balloon blast gems in the pinks. And some Donna's messaging me right now as I'm filming <laughs> some blues. I didn't put it in Do Not Disturb, so I'm getting everything's coming in. Look at these birds. These are so folk art. I love them. Oh, they are so fun. Look at this one in the corner. Oh, he is adorable. Adorable. Look at the egg. <laughs> Donna, these are fantastic. Look at the egg with the feet. Oh my goodness, I love those. Those are so cool. <gasps> Thank you so much. I forgot. Okay, Donna did a DIY. She does so many. If I can remember where it is, I will link it. Where she used <clears throat> this, this stamp here. I believe it was this one. Maybe she used another one. I know for sure in the DIY there's this one. I know. And I was like, in, her, in my comments to her, I said, oh, I absolutely love that stamp. Where'd you get it? You know, because I wasn't sure if she got it on Alley or where, because I wanted to get it. And she's like, uh, I can get it for you. So thank you so much. She said she would pick one up for me. So thank you. Oh, thank you. Now I can go create that DIY. So I will find it, you guys, and link it. So yeah. Thank you so much. It's such a pretty floral stamp, you know? Forever in time. And they have they are good stamps. So another package here. So I already know because I'm at 42 minutes. Uh, I will do Donna's memory decks in a, an, a memory decks, separate memory decks video. I'll probably put it with a uh, couple other memory decks. I've been kind of doing three per video. So I'll probably do that, Donna, just because we're at 42 minutes already and I still, this box is the, it's like Mr. Dress Up's pickle trunk. It's just never ending. Farm to table. Oh, this is going on my fridge right away. Oh, look at him. Look at the rooster and look at the, fr oh, I love this. Look at the herbs drying. I actually have to go and get my herbs out of the garden and dry them, and I do that. And then look at this. Sorry, guys. Sorry. The box, the lid from the box keeps banging the table. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to grab the rest of these things here, and then I'm going to set that box. In. There we go. Okay. So this is wood animal scenery. So it is really thick chipboard, and what you can do, the idea is you can put the rooster, no, that's a chicken, a chicken and her chick, you can stand them up and mount them. So yeah, I love that. I am going to come up with something with that. So stay tuned, everyone. Thank you, Don. I've never seen that. That is so cool. I love that. I love it. I love it. Excuse me. Trying to like save the tissue paper. What is that? <sighs> oh my goodness. So look at these peacocks. She sent me the, these peacock stickers. And they are like epoxy. They are epoxy. They say that. So pretty. Look at the pink tail on that bottom one too. Oh, well, two of them there. So pretty. And these ones. Look at these ones. So pretty. Pretty. I love these ones. This is one of my favorite stickers that Forever in Time has ever made. And oh, I love these. These are by Jot and they are um, Wildlife and Woodland. Feeling foxy. <laughs> I love it. 
Sorry about the, they're very iridescent. Sorry about glaring you guys, but look at the bee. Look at the bear and the pot of honey and the, oh, they're all so pretty. What does this say? See you soon, raccoon. I love that. We do that with our kids all the time. So that's so cool. Oh, these are so cool. So this reminds me of my, okay. I'll just show you guys while I talk. So they are little squirrel. Are they squirrels and rabbits? All kinds of animals. And they're like kids and they all, like they're camping and there's a trailer and tents, which is what my family does. But I was also a scout leader. It's the first year I'm not in many years. And uh, yeah, it just reminds me of my scout. So I will, I'm gonna incorporate this and then some other things that, um, Kelly sent me and put it like in a scouting, like a scrap, either a scrapbook page. I don't think I'll make a journal on my whole scouting, but do something. And thank you, Donna. And oh, I love these words. These are sentiment stickers. Look at the sayings. Do what you love. Choose to be happy. Be kind to everyone. Yes, be kind to everyone. Oh, thank you. I love sentiment stickers. Thank you. And then she has sent me these two gorgeous bags that I will not be able to use as bags. Look, where'd you find these? Look at this, you guys. So it's like pinks, purples, and then these gold peacock feather. Oh my goodness. These are so beautiful. So beautiful. Thank you so much. Gonna, I'm gonna come up with something with that. And then look at this one, you guys. Where did you find these? Look at, I'm gonna come up with something with that too. Look at that, it's so gorgeous. I would, I would, if this was wallpaper, I would do a whole wall with this. <laughs> I love it. Okay, Donna, you spoiled me rotten. 47 minutes of spoiling me rotten. Thank you so much, Donna. I really appreciate this. Your friendship means more to me than anything. You know that. I just love you. I cannot wait till I meet you in real life. Uh, I can't wait. So everyone, we were supposed to go out east, or east, out west this summer, like 2020. Obviously, it's 2020. We had a pandemic, so yeah, we didn't go. So I'm not sure what's, in store for next year with traveling with the pandemic or whatever but whenever we can go out there we are going to meet up and i cannot wait thank you from the bottom of my heart donna i love you girl thank you and um yeah everybody go check her out she is awesome an awesome friend an awesome creator an awesome person so go check her out i will link both channels down below Thank you, and I will do your memory decks in an overhead, okay? Thank you, bye.